and welcome back to my channel. So I am starting a work week in my life vlog as you can see from the title. Just to like intro the work week in my life, I work part time at Sephora. The location I work at is like half an hour from my house so I usually leave about an hour early. Um, I am a color consultant, beauty advisor there and I'm part time so I'm working about 20 hours a week. Then I also do YouTube and Instagram and I make some money through with that. So I usually spend my days that I'm not working doing YouTube stuff, filming, editing. It is currently a Tuesday at 2 17 and I work today from 4 to 10. Um, I'm going to do a relatively like casual look today because I'm just not feeling it. Some days I do like full out pink eyeshadow, lashes, the whole shebang. Today I'm going to do a very simple look. So I'm prepping with the Drink Elephant Lala Retro. Got this in gratis. I've really been enjoying it. For primer, I'm using the Good Molecules Priming Moisturizer. I've been really enjoying this. It was sent to me in PR from Good Molecules. It's also silicone free, which I enjoy. I don't have a lot of acne right now so I don't really need a ton of smoothing I just want to be hydrated for our foundation I'm going in with the Dior backstage face and body in 0n this is a nice light one and I want lighter coverage today my skin's been doing better so I don't really need something too intense blend that out with my real techniques sponge now I'm going in with a little more full coverage concealer because I noticed I do have a nice little breakout coming through. This is the Too Faced Born This Way in Cloud. Since that foundation is light, I'm going to go over any spots that I have because even though I'm like doing less coverage, I still want to be nice and concealed. And this concealer is very smoothing as well. And again, I'm blending that out with my Real Techniques sponge. Now I am baking my under eyes with the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder. So I'm using the ColourPop Precision Brow Pencil in Dope Taupe, the Essence Make Me Brow, and then the Essence Lash and Brow Gel. Just give like a fluffy, natural brow look. I like using lip liners when I go to work because then my lip color lasts longer. All right, and then I got this Buxom Lippy in gratis last week. This is the Powerful Plump Lip Balm in Dolly Fever. They are super, super pretty. We had a training on these and I picked out this product. I think it's very pretty, so let's try it out. Mm, it feels so nice and hydrating. I like wearing stuff like this just with a lip liner. Then I'm going to go in with bronzer, just like a mini of Benefit Hula. For highlights, I'm going to use the ColourPop Flexitarian. This is one of my favorites. So pretty and foolproof. So I'm using the Essence Lash Princess Sculpted Volume Mascara on the top lashes and the Essence All Eyes on Me Waterproof Mascara on the bottom lashes. I swear, no matter like how advanced I get with makeup and like my techniques get better and I learn more or whatever, I always still get mascara on my lids. I'm going to go ahead and brush my teeth and then put on my uniform and put pepper in her playroom downstairs and then i should have time to still go to tim's all right so i am like right beside my work right now i'm just trying to turn in there was a lot of extra construction so it took me a little bit but i made it i got my ice cap um but now because of the construction i'm gonna have to run in i won't be late i'll be just on time but i don't have much time to chat so i'm just updating while i'm at the red light i added my majuri hoops and i'm all set to go so i'll talk to you guys after i'm done work good morning guys it is now wednesday it is 10 25 i didn't vlog last night after work because i came to my car and my battery and my camera was dead so i charged everything overnight and now we are good for a new 
day. Um, today I work four to eight. I just got Pepper out of her playroom and we cuddled for 10 to 15 minutes. And I'm gonna make coffee and breakfast. And then I have been ignoring my emails for a few days. So I'm going to do those, answer some emails. I have some YouTube stuff that I wanna do. But yeah, I'm gonna make coffee, make myself feel alive, make some avocado toast. That's been my go-to lately. I do avocado with olive oil and pepper and feta and I mix it up and then use that as my spread and it's so good so I'm gonna make that make myself feel a little bit more alive and awake hopefully so let's do that so I have my coffee here I just use whatever k-cup my mom buys and then I do like a double double so like two milk two sugar two cream two sugar I guess and that's how I drink my coffee and then this is my avo toast I don't like the bread that my mom bought this week so I really loaded up the avocado and feta and everything and this will fill me up for a while it's like almost 11 so this will kind of be my lunch day it fills me up for a long time and my current routine is while i've been eating my breakfast and sipping my coffee every morning i've been watching a new mystery bella fiore has been my current favorite but i watch a different unsolved mystery true crime case and let myself just relax for however long that video is while i eat my breakfast um so i'm gonna go ahead and do that and then we will get into some agenda planning and emails and like work-ish stuff. So I'm gonna go relax and eat my breakfast. So I finished my coffee and my toast. I didn't even fully eat my toast. I just am not feeling very good, but I have zero energy and I feel pretty awful. So I'm going to try and have like a half hour nap. I know I just woke up. I don't know what else to do. I really don't feel good. So I'm gonna have a little rest. So I'll talk to you guys after I rest and hopefully feel better. It is currently 3.30. I look like I'm actually bald. I just have a slicked back bun. I ended up napping for about an hour. Then I had a sore throat and I just really am not feeling good today. So I didn't want to vlog. I don't feel good physically. I don't feel good mentally. And that's just how it's going. So I didn't really want to pull out the camera so i'm heading to work now i work from four to eight so thank god i have like a very short shift and then i'll come home and do some of the stuff hopefully that i actually needed to do today the only thing that i got done was <laughs> vlogging barely and then I answered all of my emails like brand emails and stuff so that's good I walked my dog we played outside I cuddled her tried to get in as much love as I could because I don't feel good that's what's up I will talk to you guys at 8 when I'm done work and can relax for the night that's how things are going I'll talk to you guys when I'm off work at 8 you come here my baby she can jump on my bed by herself now she jumped on my bed the other night. Your bed's even higher. Your bed's even higher. Do you want to say hi? Do you want to say hi, Squishy? Say hi to the camera. Say hello. I love holding you like a baby. I'm going to have to work out so I can do this forever. I'm going to have to work out so I can do this forever. Just wait till she's massive. Okay, it is now 8.42. Can't see that because it's super bright. But I just got home from work like five minutes ago. I got a very large steep tea on my way home from McDonald's. I actually tried to order a hot chocolate and they said they only had the size small. I don't understand why they could only have a small of a hot chocolate. But anyway, I decided to get tea. So hopefully it doesn't keep me up at all tonight. I feel like crap. Work was fine. I like got through it. It was only four hours. So I've decided that I'm gonna have a self-care night. I'm going to have a bath, do a face mask, drink my tea, light some candles or something. And then I saw that the sequel of that like cheesy teen rom-com to all the boys I loved. The sequel is out, so I'm gonna watch that while I have a bath. Okay, I'm gonna sip my tea and cuddle my squish. Look at her! What are you doing? <laughs> 
I have my tea, I have some candles lit, and then in the bath I used this Dr. Teal's foaming bath, and then I also used a bath bomb from Bath & Body Works, the A Beautiful Day one, I believe. I've never tried it before, but we're trying it tonight. To all the boys I loved before, part two. So yeah, I'm gonna go have some me time, much needed and I will talk to you guys after. All right, it is now 10.05. My bath was amazing. I haven't had a bath feel that good in such a long time. I like deep cleansed my face, put on the Drunk Elephant F-Bomb, the overnight mask, and then the Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask. Feels amazing, I feel so nice and hydrated. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and watch the rest of the movie, I'm like almost halfway through. I don't have high expectations. I just want something to make me not think and relax and that bath definitely helped. Same with the tea, feeling exactly what I wanted to. So hopefully we sleep by 11 and then I work 10 to six. So I'm gonna wake up at like 7.30 just so that I have a lot of time to get ready and do my laundry and stuff. I'm just gonna wait and do it tomorrow. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Got you. Hi, can I get a medium ice cap and two hash browns, please? Happy Thursday. It is currently 9.25. I always try and show and then it doesn't. I'm feeling a lot better today than yesterday. That bath was very much needed and really relaxed me. I had a really good sleep. Happy Friday and Valentine's Day. I recognize that I look very rough right now. I hate apologizing for my appearance in general and also on the internet, so I'm not going to. I'm not feeling great. I have a headache on the verge of a migraine. I had it last night, which is why I didn't vlog after work. I had a bad headache and slept for like two and a half hours when I got home, and then I went to bed essentially. So I'm sorry, but I didn't vlog really at all yesterday other when other than when I was driving to work. Um, my shift yesterday was actually pretty good. I felt good um, up until like when I was driving home, I started to get a headache. So I guess that's the best possible timing for that. I just cuddled with Pep for a bit. It is 10.20. I slept in a little bit. I've been up for probably an hour now. The plan for today is going to be slightly dependent on how I feel like headache wise. So this is the planner that I've been using. My mom got it for me for Christmas and I've actually been using it like every week since Christmas, which is so rare for me. It really helps me see like my work schedule and then like all the other stuff that I want to do every day. I like writing stuff down. I'm not like a phone calendar person. So on today's schedule i have a car payment which comes out automatically but i just need to make sure i have the money for that in my account i have some watch later videos in my youtube queue that i want to watch and comment on i want to start editing this work week in my life vlog and then i also want to add derek's valentine's present i picked up some stuff for him yesterday at the mall that's all i have for you guys for right now i'm gonna go sip my coffee hopefully feel better and then get some stuff done it is now 3 40 you can see there i honestly spent the last like three hours editing this vlog i have it close to where i want it but i know i'm gonna film the rest of today as well so hopefully i want to keep it like around the 15 minute mark let me know what you guys like for vlogs but that's usually around what i like to watch and the amount that i like to show so right now i'm just heading out to go to a gluten-free bakery kind of near my house it's a little bit of a drive like 15 minutes and i'm gonna get some treats for valentine's day for my mom and i were both celiac and my cramps and everything are just so bad so i really am craving something like sweet i'm feeling a lot better i did nap for a little bit after i initially vlogged and then edited for a long time as i just said so feeling better let's go get some treats for valentine's day it's now 4 38 so that took me a while look at how much of this i ate on the way home i literally ate like half of it got this bag for my boyfriend's gift got this card for derek and then i found this card in my room to go with my mom's so i'll write a little something in there and then i just got him this striped shirt these socks let's say faux show because we're both obsessed with pho and then the lip balm from jack black that i told you guys about i'm gonna write out the cards and then i'm going to do the dishes and then keep editing the vlog until dinner time Woohoo!
So I just finished writing the cards. It is now five o'clock exactly. So I just wanted to quickly show you guys something that I got in the mail today that I'm very excited about. This portion of the video is sponsored by Movement, Movement Watches. They also have some jewelry pieces and some sunglasses. The two watches that I picked out are both the signature style watches. So they're kind of the old school classic, more rectangle, narrow watch. They have tons of different styles like the classic circular watch face all those but i just thought these ones were really really cute the gold one in particular i'm super super excited about both watches came in boxes like this which is really nice you have the option to store it in the box itself i know some people might want to do that i'll probably put it with like all my other jewelry and stuff then this is what the inside of the box looks like you have the movement logo there and the watch itself and then some different links in case the watch watches don't fit or like just to make it fit for you. Um, luckily I've already tried both on and they both fit perfectly so I don't need to mess around with the links which is really nice. That there is what the watch looks like. This is the gold one. I'll link both of the exact styles down below. This one is so cute. I cannot wait to wear this. I'm actually going to put it on today. So you can see it just has the time, super sleek, no numbers. And then to link it together you literally just put it on and it clamps together. If you guys are interested in purchasing anything from Movement, as I said, they have other stuff beyond watches. So if you're interested in either of these, as I said, I will have the links to both of these watches down below, the silver and the gold. If you are interested in checking out these products and purchasing for yourself, I do have a discount code that you can feel free to use. This is not an affiliate link. I'm not making a commission or anything. It is just an extra discount for you guys. So it is Taylor Elizabeth with an underscore between Taylor and Elizabeth. I will have it on the screen here and all of the information will be in the description box. I also have my own link to shop the site that will be in the description box as well. So I think it does make more sense to just end the vlog here. Um, I'm very excited to start weekly vlogging. I definitely don't want this to be a one-time occurrence. I want to continue doing work week in my life so definitely give me feedback on this. Is it too short? Is it too long? What do you want to see more of? And thank you guys so so much for watching my work week in my life. This should be up on Sunday, but I hope you guys did. I'll have a good Valentine's Day weekend. That's all that I have for you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you so, so much for watching. Bye.